Good day Vikings, today we have something a little different. Not something I thought I would be covering yet, but with the mass popularity of Valheim it is of no surprise. I present to you today the top 5 mods for Valheim right now and how to install them. In this video we'll be covering the first person mod, equipped slots, map sync, Valheim plus and the time mod. Before we begin, please make sure you're subscribed for the best Valheim content. First up, let's talk about Nexus. Nexus is a modding website which is free to use and is currently the one-stop shop to downloading these mods. I will post all the links in the description. Having all the information in one place makes things a lot easier when applying these mods. I will be doing the manual install today as I don't feel a mod manager is required yet. Some of these mods do have some requirements, usually a file called Bepinex. The website does tell you exactly what you need. Installing Bepinex is simple. Go to the link in the description. You may need to make a free account to download by the way. But once it's downloaded, you'll want to extract the files and simply drag them into your Valheim Steam folder. There are instructions on the website and your directory will look like this if done correctly. Please, before you start trying to apply these mods, make a backup of your character and world saves. Although some of these are very simple tweaks, you do not want to risk losing all your progress. To install these mods, simply just find your Valheim save location, then you'll want to drag and drop the mods into this plugin folder. Simple. So let's start with equipment and quick slots. This is something people have been asking for since day one. Having a slot to equip your armor to, and even some quick slots on the Z, X and C key for potions. Next up we have map sync. Once again, this is a feature that has been requested since day one. This mod will simply sync all of the player's maps together. You'll want to stand close to your friend and have both of you press F10 at the same time. This will share the map. Read the instructions carefully on the page as it seems that if one of you doesn't click F10, then it is a one-way transfer. You can also share the map pins as well with F11. Maybe one of my favorites, first person. This is a strange way to play, but kind of feels right? Such a simple change has such a strong effect in game. Trolls will now look just a little bit more scary. Especially when our eye level meets up with their hairy areas. Next up with the time mod. This is primarily aimed at single player, but it will allow you to actually pause the game. So no more going to toilet and coming back to find your tame boars have been raided by drakes. Good job. Finally, we've got to Valheim Plus. There's a reason we left this for last. This mod allows you to change any factor about the game. I mean, look at the list of features here. Everything from displaying torches running out of fuel, showing experience for a skill in the top left, or changing the game entirely. This mod isn't for everyone, and I do personally enjoy playing the game as it was intended. But if you wanted to have 60 inventory slots, no structure system, or some crazy strong troll armor, then the flexibility here is yours. There's a lot going on here, but this seems to be really popular at the moment. I guess it's because it allows you to do anything you want to. As always, links will be in the description below. That's all for today. Did I miss any mods you want to know more about? Let me know in the comments below. I do live stream once a week on YouTube and Twitch, so make sure you're subscribed so you don't miss out. Thank you all for watching. Take care and all the best.